All right, all right, I'ma just say it. Meta has been on one lately. Like, I don't know what's been going on at Reality Labs, but they have truly been on a roll, and today, obviously, is no different, because today, we're talking all about the Meta all new Quest HDMI link app that literally transforms your Meta Quest device to a giant external monitor. Yep, you heard me right. Yep, a giant monitor for HDMI or a display port sources with the help of a USB capture card. The app offers video and audio streaming experiences on MetaQuest devices for game consoles, phones, tablets, and other HDMI outsources using a USB video class or UVC compatible USB video capture card accessory. This is also a huge addition to the newly added travel mode on Quest, which levels up the gaming, media, and productivity uses of the headset. This is so wild to me. As you can see here, I was able to get this up and running in no time since as a content creator, I already had a billion capture cards lying around. And if you're wondering which ones I have, don't worry. I have the links pinned in the description of the video below so you can grab one and jump into gaming. I knew immediately exactly what I wanted to do with this feature and that was bring in my iPhone screen and see if I could have it with me while I was in the headset. And after I did that, I realized, okay, maybe it's time for a little bit of productivity. So I hooked up the iPad and was able to also have a second monitor for the iPad, which is kind of crazy when you think about it. Now my, my Quest can be a second monitor for my iPad while I'm making thumbnails and things like that. It's really, really cool. And it was crazy to see iPad apps running in my Quest environment. It's just something that you just gotta test out. After testing the iPhone and the iPad, I had to jump over to the Android side to see maybe if I had a Samsung phone with Samsung Dex, it would allow me to actually operate the phone almost like a laptop or mini computer. And to my surprise, it worked really well. Had it in mixed reality, was still able to see my surroundings. But now if I wanna use the Samsung phone as the mouse and have the screen being beamed into my Quest, I can get work done while I'm also enjoying the mixed reality power of the Quest 3. Like, that that's really cool. And that was something I wasn't ever expecting to be able to do with the Quest. Now y'all know I'm a VR gamer for life, but I still enjoy flat games from time to time, but I just love playing them inside of my headset on a major huge screen. And that's exactly what I did with this new app. I was able to get my Nintendo Switch, play Streets of Rage 4, which is my favorite beat em up, well new beat em up because Streets of Rage 2 is probably my favorite beat em up of all time, you don't know nothing about that. But I also played a little bit of Mario Kart as well and it was just a lot of fun and I'm just gonna be real y'all, like it just looked freaking gorgeous in the headset, like having it running there, the frame rate was good, I had my Sonic and Chill playing which is my favorite new chill hop, like just enjoying the game, I was getting all into it, forgetting that I was playing it like inside of my quest the quest is basically become the perfect computing device that can kind of morph into different things like i'm just so impressed at the rate of updates that's been coming out for the quest and i just keep saying if we're getting these types of things now what could be coming for meta connect 2024 like honestly i don't know what else they could add to this it feels like it's already a fully featured application maybe if they added something like airplay or wireless casting so you wouldn't need any of the cables because i'm not gonna lie your boy was looking like cyborg the entire time with like a few cables hanging hanging from me. Once again, I'm gonna say at the bottom, you will find all the ones that I have found that works for me. They are affiliate links. There are no additional costs to you, but if you do use those links to buy those things off of Amazon, it will help me a ton on the channel as well. Listen, I'm just excited about where we're heading with spatial computing, with devices like the MetaQuest 3, the Quest Pro, and the Quest 2. And the point that it works on all those devices is just kind of mind blowing to me. You know what else is pretty mind blowing? You know what else you should continue to check in on? Hmm? Hmm? This channel. So why don't you subscribe? Why aren't you hitting the thumbs up? Why aren't you comment below letting us know how much you enjoyed this content and hitting that bell notification so you can know the next time a video comes because I promise you, we got a lot more content coming real soon. It's your boy Jay Dunn and I'll see you next time. Peace.